Good afternoon, fam, and welcome to Mansfield, Ohio. Today, we do the Ohio State Reformatory. All right, guys, historical marker. And we have arrived. I've been wanting to do this uh, video for quite some time. Today, we get to do a guided tour and as addition I'm gonna do a self-guided tour because I, I believe you can't film during the, the guided tours so I'm gonna try to get as much as I can I'm gonna take some photos in between but I am excited to be here all right I'm about ready to bark and going inside super cool Yeah, check in. We have an 11:30 tour. Yeah, this guy looks familiar, huh? Oh, look at the floors of these. It's really cool. All right, so it looks like here's the tour route. Probably won't be able to film during the regular guided tour, but we'll do some self stuff, some snippets. starts here. Wow, that's crazy. Pretty cool place. There's the staircase. Wow, this is amazing. Artifacts from the movie. Wow. There's the dining room. Gates Brown. Wow. This is crazy. Look at all these shanks, guys. For shanks. Oh, this is some cool stuff. All right, Levi Schofield. It's the architect. prison. Very cool. Oh, this is super cool. Oh, this cup was carved from a piece of the wood used in the making of the first electric chair in 1897. Deadliest fire in U.S. history. Wow. So here's another <laughs> guys. That's crazy.
is from the annex. Steel doors that opened the cell house to the electric chair chamber. Yeah, those are. So here's the chapel when it's filled. Not sure if we're gonna get a chance to see that or not. All right, so they give you this little gadget for your tour and some earbuds. All right, guys, these are the famous steps here. Going up. Anybody remembers these from the movie? So this is uh, Brooks in the movie, official. Um, there's the proof of his prisoner shirt. This is super cool, guys. It's got a lot of history here. There's the letter from Andy to Red. You can see his compassy head. There's good old Brooksy. The badges. Alright, so there's the record player that Andy used when he was playing over the speakers in the prison. That's really cool. Let's see. If you remember that part of the movie, that's the original record player. And there's the speakers. And this is one of the trays. They call it a uh, tray and cup. Rather one of the scenes. Pretty cool. This bad boy. I love the scene. There's the, there's the guys. So this is the warden's office. And if you look closely, you can see where they had the props for the blood splatters as they're coming in to arrest him. And of course, so that's his desk. Of course, you gotta know where his lock safe was. They put all that, the Bible had the stuff in there. That's pretty cool. And it says this was the original safe used by the movie. Very cool. And then that's that. His judgment cometh and right soon. It's pretty cool. All the original windows too, guys. So the doorknob, take a look at that. This was purposely put in there, or maybe not, I don't know. That's awesome. This is a cool thing. This picture is Andy. Tim Robbins, that is. This is the award that was given to Morgan Freeman for working on the movie, Shawshank Redemption. So this is the hat <laughs> on the prisoner outfit that Red Morgan Freeman wore throughout a lot of the film. Come see. It. It's very cool. So they say there's ghosts up in here. Seeing that they move, seen this uh, chair move. Crazy. All right, guys. So if you look at the X, this marks the spot, the center. Goes from all the different doorways. Once we get into this hallway, I'm gonna have you guys line up on the walls to the left. And then this goes up to the chapel. So Brooks was here. So this is not the original. But this is a setup for Brooksy. And then you put obviously where Red was at too. Like it was his room. But they do have the original downstairs. So we're gonna try to find that here. 
This is the cool part. Brooks was here. All right, so this is the chapel. How cool is this? So people used to be forced to be a part of the chapel and have religion. It's part of the reforming people. You can see the walls, the paint. It's crazy. We're gonna go in the east cell block. Over there is the west cell block, which I got a little picture of. Okay. But this is the east. All right, so here we go. It is scary. So this is the side that has six levels. Six levels, tier six. The other side, the, e, the west side only had five. So look, <laughs> this is creepy. So we can walk. And yeah, I'm breathing hard for a lot of reasons. It's creepy. You can see in there. It's hard to really see. But this is six high, the one of the world's tallest uh, cell blocks. And this was all created, guys, by prisoners when they came on here. The, the west side was part of the actual first construction. And this side was all built by the cell blocks. These, you can tell, they have the, the gates that roll. The other side were used were like belts and clips. Um, and they had like a thing that had, um, held them together. So these are different. Yeah, this is creepy. Guys. <laughs> oh, what the heck? This is so far up here. Look at that. There's like holes. <laughs> and this is insane. No, we still can't really see well in there. I mean, I'm legit like sketched by this, but it is, you can kind of see how far down that is. Oh, it's incredible. But this is the self-guided part, guys. I can't, part of the other part, you couldn't record. So this is kind of me um, doing my self-guided here. Great, right, so this is, stairwell here to go down but holy crap guys sketch all rama wow executives and eighties and many of them talked about during the cold winter months having to bring stuff have you got any questions in here what cell block this is so cool. This is crazy. All right, guys, so you can kind of see a better version of this. How oh, that, that works that X. Isn't that cool? It divides it equally, 100%. It was designed that way. All right, so this is what a classroom looked like when they actually reformed people. That's some trivia for us. All right, so this is um, a video looking out to the main entrance as you come in. So this is from the schoolyard. Pretty cool. So if you look right here, you can actually see a mother hole. I don't know if that's from 
the days or if that was something new, but pretty crazy. All right, so this is an actual electric chair too. So look at some of the original windows here. They say they're all original too. But yeah, look at this. Doing a lot of renovation over here. There's Andy hanging out in the corner. Red. Hanging out in the hallway. These floors are so cool too. I mean, if you look at them all, there's with the stairwell. Very, very cool. So here we are back in the front. Just some interesting facts. There's a lot of movies that actually um, were conducted here. Air Force One. Um, which was the prison scene when they're releasing the um, general, the Russian general. Um, I'm gonna try to make it over on that side to see if I can get that clip because there was a tour going on that I couldn't film. So, um, Tango and Cash, there's a scene there. Obviously, Shawshank Redemption. That was really cool. Here it is, guys. Here's the, the gate. I'm gonna show you real quick. Um, the Air Force One when they're releasing the general and then he gets shot in the middle after they rescued the president and didn't need to release him anymore so let me show you that real quick all right so that is the gate technically right that the general was supposed to get out and get released out of so i don't know if you remember that movie air force one but look it up and that is the gate he was supposed to be released at and of course they came out of this area and then the guards gunned him down before he left pretty cool huh so guys there's a lot of history this goes back to civil war times um this prison actually um was a training facility back in the civil war over i think um 500 or 5,000. i don't remember which one it was um couldn't remember all that but um uh people troops were or um people were trained here at this facility. The reason why this reformatory came out is because originally they wanted um, younger folks that didn't necessarily do some of the bigger crimes to be reformed and not be put in maximum security. So instead they brought them here, 16 to 30 year olds. And this became a thing where they wanted to get people ready. Um, they had trades, they had all kinds of stuff. Um, available for them to learn so when they are or were taken out um, yeah they were ready so it was some pretty cool history how that all how it started and then um, the pieces behind it but what a cool place this was and what a great tour um, come take the tour it's so much cooler in person I wish I could have filmed some of the stuff the guy was saying he was wealth and knowledge i um, really nice guy um, but this is something worth checking out once in your life especially if you love the Shawshank Redemption um, and all the characters that go with it so during this video um, I wasn't able to record during the actual guided tour but I did take some pictures they allowed you to do photos you're not allowed to use uh, uh, recording videos at all um, during the actual guided tour now they will let you do yourself um, guided tour by yourself and video but you're not allowed to do the whole tour you're only allowed to do snippets or snippets snippets
So one of the other things to keep in mind too, is you're not allowed to film anything to do with the adjacent uh, prison, the actual prison that's active right now. It's against the law. So no matter how much you're tempted to do it, and that's only if you're above ground level. You can of course take anything on ground level, but if you're above ground level and anywhere in the building, you're not allowed to point it towards the other prison, that's a no-no. All right, so a couple things I did learn during this uh, guided tour, which was really cool. So if you see these little holes right there where they have little um, fence pieces in there and they're tapered, that actually was given the illusion to look like the kind of like the medieval times like a castle so people could shoot bow and arrows out of there and give that illusion to do that um, then also have the protection um, of not getting hit so another cool little thing to admit during the tour all right that's it i hope you guys enjoyed the tour what a cool place what a cool facility right and uh on behalf of red and Andy and all the prisoners here they got a chance to be here part of this uh, movie Shawshank Redemption what an awesome uh, history um, or piece of history uh, to be able to be seen in person so very very cool all right so continue to wander guys we appreciate you watching thumbs up like button um, and continue to subscribe or follow and uh, love you guys we're deep in Ohio, and we got one more stop. Next next uh, stop is going to be Castle Noel. Very different. <laughs> going into the Christmas mode, checking out that in Medina, Ohio. That's our next video. We'll see you in a little bit. Love you. Continue to wander. We'll do the same. Take care, everybody.